nine years on and still seeking justice. The gay and lesbian community demands an apology from John Kwelane for what they call hate speech. Such statements are hateful. Sometimes LGBTI community are raped, are even murdered. We know these things, we see these things, we read them on papers. So we can't take such statement light. In the 2008 article, Kwelane commended Zimbabwean President Robert Mugabe for his homophobic utterances and further likened homosexuality to an act of bestiality. The Human Rights Commission received over 350 complaints on the matter, the highest ever recorded. It was clearly hurtful in terms of the severe psychological and emotional harm that was being inflicted on those individuals, that particular sector of the community. It classifies uh, members of the LGBT com LGBTI community as outsiders, treats them as different and in that basis clearly discriminates against them and impugns their dignity. Kolani's lawyers though will argue that there is no direct link between the article and hate crimes. The former ambassador is not in court due to illness. The LGBTI community says it won't give up in its fight for justice. It wants an unconditional apology from Kolani and that he be fined 100,000 rand for his utterances. The matter has been set down for two weeks. Angobam Kudu, SABC News, Johannesburg.